All right, gamers, so I thought I'd make a Banshee video today going over what he has in his inventory, and I just checked what he has, and he doesn't have too many good uh, options. Um, some standout items that he does have is Gnawing Hunger with Field Prep Demo. Um, not the greatest role in Gnawing Hunger, but it does have Demolitionist, and it also has Akira's Rounds and Hammer Forge Rifling. Um, this is going to be pretty good for PvE, especially since it's Void. It does work with some of the seasonal mods. This is a pretty alright role, and a lot of people don't actually have Gnawing Hunger, so if you're a new player out there and you want to get Gnawing Hunger with Demo, this is actually not a terrible role of it. Go pick this one up uh, but that's about it everything else is kind of just mid um, he does have the royal chase which is a very old scout rifle from season of the hunt this is about three years old now and it is a 180 void scout rifle this is pretty decent you got grave robber thresh not the best combination of perks but you know it is what it is you do have accurate rounds flared magwell i probably run flared magwell and then you have fluid barrel and full bore um, it's kind of up to you which one you want to run more range or more stability and handling and you do have a range masterwork as well um, and then the thing I wanted to go over in this video is he has literally the worst hand cannon I think I have ever seen. Um, he had a similar role the other week, but I think this one might honestly be worse. This is probably the worst weapon in the game, if I'm being honest. It is a 120 hand cannon, um, and the perks he has on this thing is hip fire grip and offhand strike. So if you guys really want a hip fire hand cannon, a hip fire 120 hand cannon, this is definitely your go-to. But this might honestly be the worst weapon I have seen in Destiny. Um, hip fire grip in this thing, giving it accuracy, stability, and precision hit targeting when firing from the hip, and then offhand strike, final blows, great additional weapon range, stability, and accuracy when firing from the hip. Um, you know, they really want you to fire from the hip with this weapon. Uh, field test is actually a really good origin trait, although, you know, on a hip fire weapon, I guess, you know, it's probably not that great. You do have appended mag and steady rounds, two of the worst things you can get in a uh, hand cannon column. And then you do have airhead break and full bore. You could run full bore for the additional range, although you're going to have zero stability and zero handling, which on a hip fire weapon is not going to be very good. And then a stability masterwork as well. Um, yeah, this thing is honestly the worst weapon I think I've seen from Banshee in a long time. Um, it's just all the perks do not mesh together at all. And it's honestly a really bad hand cannon. I would definitely recommend picking this up if you guys want probably the worst hand cannon or like one of the worst, if not the worst weapon currently in the game right now. But yeah, guys, it's going to do it for the video. I just want to make this really quick video. Go pick up the Scout Rifle and the Gnawing Hunger if you want some decent stuff today. Although, that's looking about it for anything he has good. Although, hope you enjoyed. Make sure to like and subscribe. I appreciate all of you. And have a great rest of your day. All right. Bye.